I'm back! But can I know loud? How long can a pizza be? Uh, about 14 inches. <laughs> and when I ordered the Four Seasons, I didn't think I'd wait that long to get it. Where have you been? <laughs> Pin back your ears and lap up a lug full of this. Stop! When I... huh? Tell it to the cactus, Angelo. I'm late enough <laughs> if it is. Bye! OK, Mr Cactus. Prick up your ears. There I was, coming out the shopping food. mall. When... <sighs> what kept you, pal? Give me. <laughs> you should ask, Mike. There I was, coming out of the shopping mall. Forks. Hey, knives, forks. Give me a hand here, will you? I might as well talk to the wall. Oh, Mike, what do you think I should do with it? Hmm? The hold all. The hold all. What should I do with the hold all? Well, let's see. You could climb inside and use it as a bod sleigh. Or tie the handles to a tree and make a hammock. Or, if you felt real adventurous, you could always use it to carry things in. No, uh, you don't understand, Mike. It's not mine. I just picked it up. Angelo, I'm trying to watch the news here. Will you zip it? It's already zipped. And ordered the staff to hand over half a million pounds in five pound notes. Come and look at this. The man demanded that the money the was placed in There's been some trouble down at the mall. Hold -alls. What kind of trouble? Some guy held up the bag. Oh, the man aimed a must have strong arms. <laughs> he made off with half a million smackaroos. Listen. The robber then ran through the mall carrying the two hold -alls full of the stolen money. There, he was seen to meet up with another man, who police are convinced was also involved in the raid. The robber's accomplice was caught on the mall security cameras. <laughs> seen here, making off with one of the bags. <laughs> This is the holder, the holder with the with the with the money. It can't be. You saw the TV. That was you there holding this holder. Where on earth did you get this? I told you. A man just dropped it and ran off. I ran after him, but he wouldn't stop. What a tits ball. Yeah, that's what I thought. Not him. You. Didn't you realize he was a bank robber? No. What do bank robbers look like? Anyway, I couldn't see his face. How come? We had this stocking pulled over his head. And you didn't think that was suspicious? Well, not really, no. I just assumed he got dressed in a hurry. <laughs> oh, will you please stop wittering? Come on, Katie, where are you? Oh, thank heavens. At last, she probably forgot her keys again. <laughs> Evening all. Archie McDuff, CID. What? You mean... Police. Police! <laughs> oh, fine. Looking for a <gasps> Mr. Angelo. Who? Mr. Angelo. 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 How do you spell that? A-N-Jello. Can I come in? Oh, him. Angelo, Angelo. Now I know who you mean. But, uh, we don't actually call him Angelo. We, uh, call him... Fred. Fred. It's a uh, kind of a nickname. <laughs> so where is he then, your mate, Fred? He's not home yet. You know, son, obstructing the police is an extremely serious offence. I wouldn't like to have to arrest you both. Arrest? We know who he is. We know what he did. Now save us all some time and trouble and bring him here. Mr. Angelo. Where are you hiding, son? We know you're here. <laughs> Where are you hiding, son? Angelo! Hey, Angelo! Where are you? Somebody looking for somebody? <laughs> My name's Archie. CID. C.I.D. spells Archie. Not in the school I went to. In my school, C.I.D. spelled fruit bat. 
which only goes to prove what a lousy education I got. Mr. Angelo, I presume. You presume right. In fact, you presume far too much. Now let me presume something. I presume you iron that raincoat with a lawnmower. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Not if you don't mind me giving you a few answers. Not here, pal. Maybe you'd like that company me at the station. Why? You frightened of getting mugged on the platform? The police station. It's called helping the police with their inquiries. Geez, I'd love to, but uh, as you can see, not right now. I'm in the middle of taking a bath. You are coming <laughs> with me, Chuck. Oh, let's go quietly now. Move. <laughs> <Ow. laughs> Hello, Mike. We'll be back real soon. <laughs> Don't bank on it, Sonny. Oh. <laughs> Say bye-bye to your pal, Fred. Hello. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Hi, I'm home. Oh, Katie, thank heavens. Yeah, my masterpiece. The end result of two months worth of pottery classes. It's great. Listen, we have to talk. My pottery teacher says when it comes to molding clear and natural, it's all the practice I get squeezing Angelo's neck. Katie, what? Angelo's done the most stupidest thing in the world. No. Angelo is the most stupidest thing in the world. Okay, what's he done now? You better sit down. It's a long story. I'll make it short. Angelo's been arrested. Not that short. He found this bag of money and the police think he stole it. Oh, Mommy, Daddy. So I told him, wait till Katie gets back. Katie will know what to do. What do we do, Katie? Katie! We call the police and tell them what happened. Oh, but they won't believe a word of it. <laughs> I don't believe a word of it, but the truth will out, Mike. I always remember that. Hello, is that the police station? Let me talk to someone in charge, please. Thank you. All Angelo has to do is give them back the money. That should get him off the hook. Can you show her? Of course, I'm sure. Oh, hello, yes. My name is Katie Andrews, and... Well, what's up? That's funny. It's dead. That's right. <gasps> and so will you both be if you don't do exactly what I say. Who in blazes are you? Where's the money? Oh, my gosh. You're him. Katie, it's him. Him who? Him who robbed the bank. That's him who. Oh, is that right? Well, listen up, Buster. You can't just come barging in here like this. Get out. Go on, scram. You don't scare us. Oh, dearie me, your phone seems to be broken. Just tell us where the dosh is, son. And if I don't? If you don't, certain other things might start to get broken as well. Know what I mean? Tell him where the money is, Mike. I don't know. Oh, come on now, Mike. Let's not upset the nice man. Give him the money. There's a good lad. I'm telling you, I don't know where it is. Angelo hid it. Where? Where, Mikey? Where? Where did he hide it? I have no idea. He didn't say. Well, that's a shame, isn't it? Oh, this is a very nice vase. Oh, hey, come on, give it back. Katie made that. Get away, really? She's been working on it for two months. Well, you mean you painted all these lovely flowers and birds and everything? Yeah. Oh, it's charming. Really delightful. Thanks very much. <laughs> oh, dearie me. Oh, you big creep show. No, Mike, please don't. Now then. Do you want to repeat the question, or shall I? I'll do it. <laughs> Mike, there's a time to be a hero, and there's a time not to be a hero, and this is a time not to be. Where's the money? Honest, Kate, I've no idea. Can't help you, pal. All right. Well, I'll just have to ask the weirdo then, won't I? Where is he? Oh, uh, he went out. And when will he be back? Oh, he could be gone a long, 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 long time. Does it matter? I'm not in any hurry. We'll wait. Why don't we all sit down?